who had some amazing swims already here. Thomas Navikonis from Lithuania will swim on lane A. David Dalla Costa from Italy. The one on lane one. Ralf Dalaiden from Luxembourg on lane seven. Vladis Reznichenko from Russia on lane two. He was the one who brought the gold for the Russians in the last leg of the free relay on the opening day. Mateusz Kiovaniec from Poland. It's going to be an interesting thing to see him. And Edward Mildred was already part of the 100 butterfly final on lane three. Diogo Ribeiro also warmed up in the 100 meter butterfly. And they are the ones who try to challenge the mighty David Popovici. There were some discussions that there were his 4808 swim yesterday in the semis would be a championship record or should we could send it a championship record his junior world record from the first day which he set in the relay remember that 47 56 blast from Popovici in the relay was not only just the new junior world record but also the fourth best time in the entire world on senior level, so he's fourth, he sits fourth with that in the senior world ranks. Let's see if he offers us something similar. A swim under 48. So far, the others couldn't go under 49, so Bobovici should bring this home. Let's see the other. Edward Mildred, for instance, the Brit was also outstanding. He was offered the re-swim after he missed his heat. But here you can see that Popovici is really a cut above the rest. Already half body length over the first meter. He is beyond the split of his junior record by one tenth under 13. It's even it's 22.97. It's even a good result in the 50 meter free so let's see it's only the clock let's see the time he could achieve oh yes it is a new junior world record 47 30 amazing amazing and edward mildred is the second this 48 77 he managed to dip under 49. And Mateusz Kiovenets from Poland is third. let me tell you that this time is not just a junior world record but the best time 